Papa. Uh, Make sure you take your medication like the doctors prescribed. I, I will, I will. Uh, just uh, have a journey mercy. Drive carefully. I will. Uh, yeah. As for those boys, I have given the DPO some money to detain them until I come back from my journey. <laughs> That's a good one. If I, you are the true son of your father. You can say that again, Papa. Uh -uh. Mm -hmm. uh, I have to be on my way now. Hey, okay. Hey, Johnny Messi, eh? Shimobi! Nah. So you have grown so much wings. Now what has come over you? I'm asking you. So you have grown so much wings and made money to the extent you've forgotten who Adana is in this compound. I'm asking you. I'm not here to talk about the issues your father had with my younger brother, Odinaga. Now look at you. So do you think now, with all the things you've made in life and your connections, that you can match my husband when he comes after you? Um, I, I don't... Hey! Allow Papa. me to speak to your son. Papa, allow her to talk. Let her, let her rant. Oh, you shut up! Let her rant. Are you mad? I can steal in front of your father and beat you because I'm your elder sister. Akoko. Are you mad? One more word from you till I finish, then I will teach you a lesson. Repeat that thing again. Rubbish. What has come over your children of nowadays? I'm asking you. So because you've made so much money, you've got connections. Now the first way for you to show off your wealth and everything is for you to put your two cousins behind bars. Shame on you. You were just three years old when your mother died. And I took good care of you. I took you like my own baby brother. I changed your napkin. I petted you. I did everything for you. Ask this your father that is here. I took you to school. You were always crying. And I was busy buying Accra for you. So you can close your mouth and follow your mates and stay in the class. I was always petting you. I was always there for you. What has come over you? I'm asking you. I can beat my hand on my chest to tell you that I'm the first auntie you have that bought sandals, school uniform, pencils, books for you to become human being that you are now. So the only way you can repay my kindness bringing you up is for you to behave like this. Oh, it was even Adenaka who broke uncle's head. And you could not even come to tell her that, nah. You went behind my back to lock your two cousins and sell. Shame on you. Oh, it's not even touching you, right? Now, because of your stupidity, Eliezer couldn't even take care of his wife. Couldn't even see his wife in the hospital. Ephonania is lying dead. With the little child in her womb. Now, I want you to listen to me. With everything you have, get ready for me when I come for you and you. Get ready. Don't mind that man. Papa, don't mind her. Let her go and carry her husband. I am ready for them. What, what would they do? Do they have two heads? Son, you don't speak with so much confidence. Oh. <laughs> Odile has money, so much money. Papa, then you don't know your son. You don't know why they call me a girl My money is new and their own is old. They should go and do whatever they want to do. I am ready for them. See, as a matter of fact, I am getting Mopo to mount you in this compound. Let me see who will come and touch you. Papa, I have to be on my way. Okay, Johnny Messi, eh? I'm sorry. It's not like I abandoned your no, 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 no. The truth is, my younger brother Eliezer had issues with my uncle and they took him to the police station. He has been in police custody since then. That's what I've been running around. So I just came to tell you so that you will not, you know, feel like I abandoned everything. I didn't. She's alive. 
Yes, what I mean, Elieze is um, he has been in police. I mean, she is alive. If not, yes, is alive. It's not true. But it's, it's not possible. Look at her. She's not. Give us the children that will, you know, stay for us. We must... Doctor, what is this? She's free to go. What is this? She's free to go. I've also settled her medical bills. Doctor, you've paid the money. Yeah. Thank you, Doctor. Don't do that. Thank you. Ma, don't do that. Don't do that. Please, please, please don't do that. Thank you. Hospital bill. Right. Settled. Power of The nurse will go to the dispensary and get her prescription. Yes. That will keep her stronger. Thank you. You're blessed. God bless you. You're blessed. You will live long. You will live long. God bless you. Ifunanya, thank you for fighting back to life. I'm proud of you. Like slaves, slaves. This suffering is too much. I suffer why? I suffer why? Problems every day. Oh God, where are you? The pain is too much. The pain is too much. I suffer why? I suffer why? Problems every day. My God, where are you? that I passed out for over 10 hours. You didn't lie. You died. Ifunanya. Uh, hey! You died! We were even planning to put your body in the mortuary. Hey! How you got up? <laughs> ha! That's a miracle. Wait, Chelo. So Chimo be arrested my husband and, and Odinaka? Eh? It's alright. It's okay. I promise you. I will bring them out today, today, not tomorrow. Jerry will just go and uh, bring Angel back from school, and Angel will come and stay with you. Thank you. So while I run around. Thank you. God will bless you. <laughs> hmm? You know I call you Ne Mama. Hmm? It's okay. So after all the sleepless nights, the pains. Ah! I. I. This is now. Oh! There's something I want to tell you. You see, the Almighty God that gave us this child will still bring another one for us. All I want you to do is just to put all these things behind you. Ah! This is so I don't. Just stay here. Let me bring out this. 
please, I love you. Eh? Don't get up, please. Stay with me. Since I came back from the hospital, I have not set my eyes on my husband. <laughs> Very good. <laughs> Very good! See, whenever he comes back, or whenever at all he decides to come back, tell him that he should not go anywhere close to my keke. He should not even smell it at all. You hear me? Other people's keke are on the road making money. My own is here. He has the mind to park my keke in this house. Anyways. Okapo, we are not quarreling. <laughs> eh? Piku, I, 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 honestly, I've not seen my husband. But when he comes back, I will pass the information to him. Well, I don't have any problem with you. It's your husband I have an issue with. We should not go anywhere close to my kitchen. Okapo, take it easy. I'm not joking with all of you. No, we are not quarreling. Is important no, we are not quarreling. What kind of life is this now? If he takes this keke now, if he takes this keke, how are we going to manage? Eh? What kind of life is this now? What kind of life is this? Okay, 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 okay. Honey, do you want another round? I know I'm tired, but I, I can let you, you know, satisfy yourself more. Are you sure? Of course, sure. Of course, you know I always want more. Hmm? But let me rest a little bit, okay? <laughs> <laughs> All right, in that case, let me go and prepare food for us. Okay, at least that will give me some strength. I know. <laughs> I'm coming. Okay. Mm.
What is this woman up to? I hope she's not up to something cynical. I know. <laughs> this is so delay. Whatever she likes to bring to the table, I'm prepared for it. Bring it on. Bumper to bumper. Today not today. <laughs> ah. Suffer. Please don't start. Please don't start. I beg you, please. Make me remember what I forgot. Don't make me remember how I suffered to carry my own punch. Please just be the man that you are. Please. Please. Why are you two acting like babies? Please stop. Who threw me inside cell? He just threw me inside cell and I didn't even have the opportunity to come see my pregnant wife. My baby wouldn't have been dead if I were there. Hi, Uncle. Uncle. You used this means, this device to eat up my baby. My first strength. Please, if you two of you should stop this. Stop crying. It's enough. Hmm? This is not the reason I called for this meeting. Please. This is the only family I have. I don't have anything apart from you people. I have suffered though. I have suffered. I have been toiling since the day our parents died to see if this family will be a bit better. Take a look at my father's compound. Just see my two brothers. Look at my brother's beautiful wife. How she's suffering. Mm -mm. Enough. I can't bear this again. I can't. I can't. Sister, you have to be. You have to have some patience. My husband and his Odinaka, they will be fine. It's okay. Tifunanya, I, I just, I just knew it that your own pep talk will piss me off. I just knew it. Everything will be fine. Everything will be fine. When exactly? We go came case more. Is it? Is it when when we are dead? No, tell me. Tell me what I, what the Naka Christian has, have not done in this life to survive. What about your husband, Odinaka? He has tried all he could. What does he have to show for it? It is nothing. Now, I wrap on this pep talk, Biko. Forget it. I'm boiling. Odinaka is right. Yes, he is. He's, he's good. There's nothing I've not done. I've done literally everything to make money, to make this money. But yet, it's not working. It's not working. No, who did we offend? I do Yahoo. My mates do. Nothing. Nothing. Nothing at all. I follow Juju. I say because it's not my calling, nothing will work out for me. And finally, I entered church. 
Castor Burubia. Money, 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 money. I sow seed, I pay tithe, I sow seed of wealth. I even had to sow seed of tiny, tiny money. And Kichuku gave me more season. But nothing. Nothing. Nah. Just leave this thing. Let us talk something else. I pony horns of Biko. This suffering is too much. The suffering of our problems every day. I can't bear it. The pain is too much. The pain is too much. I can't bear it. The suffering of our problems every day. My God, where are you? Kaboom. Your word, the usual way. Thank you, Grandmaster. You are welcome. Kabush. 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 I can see your wife coming to eliminate herself. wife has bought a poisonous substance and she plans to take her life, her own life, at zero zero hours of the day. Oh, did you wear your ring? You will not allow her to do that. She must not die because she's still very, very important to you. As a matter of fact, she is your only WMM world making machine. The only one. I've heard you, Grandmaster, mm. that people are beginning to wag their tongues uh, that uh, my wife and her family are wallowing in abject poverty. While I am a multi-billionaire, that is worrisome, Grandmaster. Kaboosh! Kaboosh! Oh. Yes, people are entitled to their own opinion and they are free to express it. But what is very important here is for you to remain Focus. Mind your business. Lastly, the very day you use your warning to help her, that very day, abject poverty will turn to you. No, no, not me. Um, well, Grandmaster, I've heard you. Uh, I will do exactly as you have instructed. Billionaire Odile. <laughs> Go and enjoy your work. Let her brothers perish in penury. <laughs> <laughs>
Hosiana, please now. Eh? Please. No, please. Uh, what, uh, what happened was intentional. See, 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 see. Hey, 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 hey. I don't hear anything from you again. Just give me my key. Uh, is it by force? I was in the police custody. Hey. I'm a mom, ma. Oh, okay, allow me to just use it for today and tomorrow. I will remit. Listen to one. me. Please. I have come with a more serious person who is ready to do business. No, give me. Okay, he will explain to give you. Give me the key business. now. He will explain to you more what is in this. Give me, give me, give me. Give me. Give me. Give me. Give me. You, that's this thing. That's that. Let's go. Understand me now. When I get to the was I talking with you? He is none of my business. I have targets for me. Okay, please. I don't know you now. You want to see that tonight. Mama, no. I will be not drying. Mama, we need you. We want to see that now. And again, now. Eh? What kind of nonsense is this now? What is this now? What, what is this? Eh? It's okay. It's not okay. It's not okay. Well, what will I do? Eh? This is the only cake I've been managing. Eh? Where, where do I start from now? For me, cannot we? Prove me another way. Just relax. Oh. Mm? It's okay. Let me stay here. How can I go inside if you stay here? How do you want me to feel? I don't like this you are doing. No, me, I don't like it too. I don't to like it. Now? I don't like it. If you can, now what will I do now? Yeah? So, how's your night? It's alright. I don't know. Don't ever try what you did last night. Don't ever. Is that understood? Why not? Why? Why am I leaving? I want to die. Oh, you cannot die. Oh. Oh. Adelaide. What have you done? I'm supposed to be dead. What am I living for? What am I living for? I want to die. Oh. Oh. That land belongs to me and not to my late brother, Coco. How can you say that? Oh, Keke, how can you say such a thing? We all know that late Ozemene and his family farms on that land. How did it become your land? Hey, look. If you are looking for the truth, then you better believe me when I tell you that the land belongs to me. It is my land. I show KK on that land. Mazi KK. Huh? Tell us how that land belongs to you. Good. Good, I will tell you. Now listen. When my brother was alive, he came to me and borrowed a large amount of a huge amount of money. Very big. He said he was going to use that money to train aliens here in the university. Now, he used that land as a collateral. And until he died, he did not return the money. Now, my son wants to build on that land. And these ones are saying, no, he cannot build. Imagine. Does Look at him, Mabu. This is this is this Mabu is ridiculous. Yes, no. Let me ask you, let us understand what happened. How much did you lend your brother? Ah, 200,000 naira. Eh? Which today amounts to millions. Millions. This man is a liar. This is a bloody lie. Okay, Mr. Lukidia. How can you be calling the father of new money a liar? 
Don't, are, are, you not, are, you, are you not afraid, Simon? Be better watch your tongue. You know I'm planning for you. Watch your tongue. Mr. Head, maybe I should. Die, die, die. Enough. Me, are, are you mad? Okay. Enough. Enough about this. No problem. No problem. Um, Eliezer, what do you know about this land in question? What do you have to tell us? My others are great here. I'm open the agents of women or what? Hmm? But I will say that on that fateful day, my father called me and asked me to escort him to Mazio Keke's house and my uncle here. So when we got there, my father brought out a huge amount of money and handed it over to him and said to him, I quote, this is the money you gave to me to train Eliezer in school. And my uncle collected that money and said, thank you. Mom. And now told my father, you can now have the land back. So I don't know why he's behaving like this. Eh? Or you think I, I will not recall what happened that day? Maybe. Hey! Maybe. Hey! So you are such a fat liar. This young man here is a bloody liar. Huh? Huh? Hey. You know, you is that know. what you learned in the university? How to lie? I did not lie. You're a liar. Hey! It is it. Uh, Very good, then. Very good. Since this is the way you want it, we are going to bring the Abara and you will swear. Oh, yes! You will swear if you are telling the truth that if that land belongs to you, you will live long. But if you are lying, you will die a shameful and a painful death. Can, can you imagine? Brother? See, I am leaving this place. I can, I can see. But I'm leaving here. I can see. You, 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 I'm you, going. You, you're not afraid. But let's go. That my, my father should go and swear on Abana. Can you imagine? It's just for him. No, no fear again. It's uh, just for, for him to tell us that he's the truth. Is it not obvious my father is saying the truth? It's just for him to tell us that he's saying the truth. Just put that. If your father is saying the truth, we will find out. This time around, I will send people to Kuja prison. And nobody will release any of you. Me! I will send them to prison. No problem. Hey. Happy hour. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Chimobi. Huh? Your father is my brother. I know your father too well, more than you do. Oga Nui. Onguchiya. Approve or innocence here. Yeah. Uh, My father is innocent. Uh, we are not saying he's not innocent. But that's the way we do things traditionally here. Yeah. It's it. just for him to prove to everybody he's that he's saying the truth. I'm waiting for is, is it not clear? Uh -huh. Uncle, is it not clear? Then let him go. How ahead. can the father of Ego Fulu be lying? Papa Rafa can get go for huh? eh? My money is new. Ego Chief, man, they go yeah. uh, okay, okay, go uh, is uh, 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 Abara. Yes. Bring that one, I will swear. In, in fact, today, I want to see that Abara today. I will swear by yeah, that Abara. Bring it. I promise you. Bring that Abara here. Let you me swear. You know what? Okay. That Abara can go. Okay. 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 I'm a Kwamba Kala. You mean she came back tonight? Yes. Yes. This is a miracle. Indeed. Indeed, it is all. Please. Just that um, she lost her baby. Oh, so sad. So sorry about that. Oh, so sorry. Oh. There's something I've been meaning to ask you, girls. Okay. What is it? Mm. Talk to us. Yeah, talk to your friends. They are listening. How do you treat a sex maniac? A sex maniac? Wait. 
You mean your husband loves sex? <laughs> Love is an understatement. I'm talking about he loves it like madness, oh. like crazy, as in he eats it like food. He he inhales it like, you know, breath. He, he loves it. Whenever he sets his eyes on me, he wants to have sex with me. And even during your modest during my period I'm talking about every day, every hour. I said, every blessed day. He doesn't get tired of it. He can even get tired of going to office. He can get weak, you know, coming down from upstairs. He, he, he can even get tired of eating, but he doesn't get tired of having sex with me. Mm. Each time, whenever he sees me, he would want to have sex with me. You know, he doesn't even care if I'm dying, if I'm going to collapse, if I'm going to faint, okay. even if I'm telling him that I'm weak, like... It's okay, you will die no more. He likes it like crazy. Wow. You will die no more, okay? Wow. We will die for you. Eh? Wait. Eh, I'm not going to die with you. Yes, I, I, but have you tried to find out why he does that all the time? Hey, is it a um, lack of... Uh, is, is it like a lust or lack of self-control? Yeah, it's not. I think you should go and ask him. I'm dying. That's the bottom line. I'm dying in this marriage. In fact, I'm dead. Is, is, it, is it that bad? You like, be dead? Can't be dead. A sex maniac. A sex maniac. Meaning he loves sex no. all the time. Why are you so killer? How? It's okay. You know how you feel. Hmm? Child. You will not die. You will not die. You, you will never die. It's not possible. We are living in pains. No one to help us. Every day by day, from one trouble to another, we have no joy. No peace of mind, we are like slaves. Slaves. This suffering is too much. I'm so wild, so wild. Problems every day. I don't know where I am. The pain is too much. The pain is too much. I'm so wild, so wild. Problems every day. My God, where are you? The pain is too much. I'm in a moment. I'm a moment. Problems every day. My God, where are you? The pain is too much. Wonder shall never end in this part of the world. Hey, this one, you shook me. You shook me real hard. Or more, you shook me die. Hey, how can Ada's younger brother and his wife be selling fruits by the roadside? With all the money that Chief used to spend on us alone, he couldn't help his in-law and his wife. It's unbelievable. This is crazy. Crazy indeed. I really don't want to believe this. Huh? This is this is disgraceful. It's really it's crazy. Shameful. It's really crazy. To his so... name. Ha. Hmm? Am I sure I'm seeing? I'm seeing very well. 
Chief Ode. Hmm. This is unbelievable. I know. There's supposed to be a money. He's supposed to be a money with his wife. Having such a love. And yet, this is the way the woman was sweating. Eh? And the man was finding that a crime. Chief, I'm wait. What do you want me to say or do? Nothing. Even though their food looks fresh, but they're not supposed to be selling fruit by the roadside. It's none of my business. Uh -uh. Yes, it's not a shock. It's a shock, Miss Owens. What will make I do? Uh -huh. I beg mm -hmm. Oh my God, where is my sister? Catch it, catch it. Chief. How are you? I'm fine, sir. Good to see you. Thank you. Uh, so, how's your business? Chief, business is bad. Things are not really going the way I planned. Kachi, I know you. You always have one problem or the other. Eh? So what is it this time? Chief, you know I've always been a hustler, but Things are not really going the way I planned. Mm. Okay, so what of your film business? Well, Chief, the movie is not moving. I've spent three million naira in the movie, but I've not gotten any return. Chief, things are really bad for me. It's all right. Um, Jeffrey? Jeffrey? Go and get me my briefcase. Alright, sir. Kachi, Kachi. Look, it bleeds my heart when you complain about money. Okay? <laughs> you are my godson. So don't hesitate to ask me for money anytime you need it, okay? No problem, Chief. Thank you, Chief. Thank you. Buy something. No naira, all dollars, okay? Thank you, Chief. Chief, really great. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Chief, this is too much. I'm really grateful, Chief. I'm really grateful. Chief. Uh, look, look, look. I told you, whenever you have money issues, in fact, Whenever your business starts going down, come to me. Okay, I'll sort it out for you, okay? Chief, this is really great. I'm really grateful. This is too much. This is too much. You're great. Oh, this is too much. I'm great. I'm great. Okay. I need an explanation from you. I need you to tell me the reason you hate my brother so much. Why? Is it a bad thing? That they are your in-laws. Why? If not for anything. Can't you see that I am their only sister? People are tagging me. Wife of a billionaire. Yet! I cannot even boast of 20,000 Naira. My brothers are dying in abject poverty. What is the reason? What is your pride? You cannot even help them. But I have seen you picking boys from the streets, making them billionaires, millionaires. I was there. You helped Kachi. Kachi is now a millionaire. Philip! Millionaire now. Mike! Mike! Milonina. What of Kachi? I mean, this Kachi is now a millionaire. You don't even want anything to happen to their businesses. You don't even want their business to cough. Oh! Mm. You pump money. What is stopping you from help 
been my own brothers. What kind of a man are you, Odale? A man that is very reasonable. A man who doesn't throw away his money at clueless people. Really? Your brothers are clueless. They know nothing about business. Look at my time. I hustled. I hustled to make every single dime that I have today. I allow them to hustle. Let them stand as men. Now let me tell you something. Do you know the butterfly? When the butterfly wants to come out of the cocoon, it struggles. And that force, that effort that it uses to come out of the cocoon, it's that force that made it to survive, to fly. If you help the butterfly out of the cocoon, it dies. That's exactly what I'm trying to do to your brothers. I want them to stand on their own feet and be proud that they made every single time that they have like I did. Is that not wickedness? Are you not being too wicked? Kai! Odele, look at me. If not for anything, I am your wife. You sleep with me each time, each hour, each second. The woman that gave birth to a beautiful daughter for you. Chai, pity me and help my brothers. If you want me to go straight on the floor, Nam, I will gladly do it just for you to pity them, look upon them with a merciful eyes and help them. Adanaya, help them. You are correct. I am trying to help them to stand on their own feet. I'm trying to help them to be men that can be proud tomorrow, that they work hard for whatever they have. That's exactly what I am doing. Enough. Enough! This is madness. I'm done being your slave in this marriage. I'm walking out of this marriage. In case you didn't hear me, I said I am done. D-O-N-E, done! Being your slave. How dare you? How dare you threaten me? Friends! Orderly! My question is... Am I not good enough for you? Answer me, Orderly! What do you want? You want me? So tear my heart out before you realize that I'm your wife. For you to give me that little respect. What do you want? I'm asking you. Stop ranting. Stop ranting. I am not going after your friends. Get it into your taste call. I am not going after your friends! 